seen the images, whether from the Kalamazoo oil spill or from other oil spills, of animals covered in oil. We've seen the banks of the Kalamazoo River, shores of the Gulf, shores in other regions, covered in black oil. Now imagine that on the shores of our Great Lakes. Imagine going to visit our Great Lakes and seeing them covered in oil. Imagine the wildlife around the entire state of Michigan covered in oil should line five rupture in the same way that the pipeline did in the Kalamazoo and Wild Creek area. The idea of my children not having healthy lakes to visit, of not having clean drinking water, of not having an environment that will be sustainable into their future is terrifying for me and there's no amount of money worth the risk that Enbridge is taking with our futures. We can imagine oil covering the shorelines of our Great Lakes, but we can also imagine a different future, a renewable future, a future in which everybody uh, is protected, the public health is protected, the health of our ecosystems are protected, we have clean water to drink, and a, and a renewable future. Green energy jobs are one of the fastest growing sectors in the state, so when we hear about the economic impact of shutting down Line 5, I don't think that's a viable argument. Let's move into the future, let's move into renewable energy, green energy jobs, and let's preserve and protect the future of all of the children of this state. Well, let's show our state some love. Let's show the children in the state some love, the families in the state some love, our environment, the animals in the state some love, and let's shut down line five. Thank you.